Hello Queens, welcome back. It's Queen and Queen She Me and today we have another Sephora unboxing. If you haven't already done so, please subscribe to my channel. I upload here weekly featuring natural hair, beauty, and lifestyle content. So if it's something that you would like for me to actually bring to my channel in a future video, just leave a comment below and you never know. It may be actually featured here on my channel. So let's go on ahead and get to this video Queens. So for those of you who are familiar with my channel, um, you guys already know that every month I pretty much get a play box from Sephora and this subscription is only $10 a month including shipping and handling you pay $10.75 and every month you get about 4 to 5 deluxe size samples of beauty products it can range from hair care skin care and even makeup and so this month this one is called fall into beauty so this is their theme for the sephora play box for september 2017 and it's so cute it has a polka dot theme and of course this is my 50 um beauty bonus points pretty much and i can spend them at sephora and you can use them for new um samples that they actually have featured for the month or whatever um they may actually have at your local Sephora and you can probably also use this online I've never tried to actually use my deluxe points I mean I'm sorry my beauty insider points online so I'm not sure if you can use them online you guys but if you can that's dope because a lot of times online they have even more um, deluxe size samples that you can choose from with your beauty insider points so definitely definitely check out sephora.com if you guys are wanting to know more about the actual subscription so this month again this one is called fall into beauty and i know that they actually did just come out with a new community um yeah the beauty insider community and i'm not quite familiar with it i know that you can go on there and share your reviews your thoughts you know um and i think they've now added more features to it so i'm actually about to check this out you guys so this is our bag for the month and it is so cute like i don't know what it is with them in this pink but this pink is so freaking sexy you guys know i love pink so anything pink i'm automatically sold on and yeah so this one says a change of face so that's what it is for this month so going in no particular order you guys this is the fresh lotus youth preserve face cream with super seven complex and this is a seven milliliter container and this is for fresh beauty and oh my gosh you guys like that is so dope so let me go ahead and actually take this out of the package it says on the packaging fresh lotus youth preserve face cream is a universal daily moisturizer proven to provide 24 hours of significant moisture damn it is formulated with a propriety super 7 complex specifically designed to minimize and prevent visible signs of aging in maca root extract noted for enhancing luminosity Ooh, so pretty much you're gonna get your all-in-one this is a pretty much is a very very super hydrating facial cream and this is what the packaging looks like you guys it is so cute and so I actually just want to try some on the back of my hand oh it doesn't have a scent to it um we're just gonna rub that on the back of my hand and see how that actually absorbs into the skin you guys because you guys know i'm all about skincare um that's primarily why i shop at sephora it's not really for the makeup it's primarily for skincare honestly and if you're wondering what's on my lip this is a brown lip liner from nyx and then on top of it i went over with the um new um, gloss bomb from Fenty Beauty and you guys this has been like my favorite like I've been using the hell out of that stuff so back to the cream so we're just gonna rub this in Ooh, and it absorbs into the skin very nicely it has a very smooth texture to it you guys oh man and I just really like the finish on that um it's not greasy I feel I would probably want to use this at night time okay now you can smell it yeah you can tell that it does have an extract in there of some form it smells really good it reminds me of like a melon scent so yeah i love fresh beauty because all of their products are never um they're not strongly fragranced um they are a little bit on the pricier side but i do love their products from fresh beauty so i'm familiar with them 
and I'm gonna have to try this out so again this is the Lotus Youth Preserve face cream with super seven complex you guys and again this is a seven milliliter container and I cannot wait to actually like use this at night to see how my face is actually gonna react to it but initially on the back of my hand I like the way that it feels I like the texture of it we have a contour eye pencil and this is the Sephora contour eye pencil 12 hour wear and it is a waterproof eye pencil so um eye pencil I believe is a mascara you guys I mean an eyeliner you guys so cool and I didn't put any eyeliner on today so let's actually see um how this works they do have a lot of other shades on the back so let me just show you guys the packaging and this is their waterproof mask I mean I keep on saying mascara it's eyeliner this is their waterproof eyeliner and then they list all of the shades that they actually have you guys and then they have more of them on the back so they have a variety of shades to choose from so if you're one of those girls who wants to actually try out Sephora products but you know you're just not really looking to splurge and spend a whole lot of money try the Sephora collection a lot of people sleep on them Sephora has a lot a lot a lot of nice makeup goodies you guys as well as skincare as well so if you're wanting to know more just look back on my previous videos you guys I have like over 200 something videos on my channel and um yeah and I have a lot of Sephora actually I have a lot of Sephora hauls here on my channel so just look back on my videos so let's go ahead and swatch this on the back of my hand that is so creamy that is so creamy I like the way that that felt on the back of my hand it went on really really smoothly um you can actually go in with a light hand um because initially if you guys cannot tell on this one I was heavy handed and then on this one I was actually light on it so you can see the difference on the um product and then actually how it actually does come out I actually want to go ahead and try this on camera so I'm just going to use my Sephora mirror and I actually got this with a gift card that I received you guys so let's go ahead and try out this mascara okay y'all I keep saying fucking mascara but this is a damn eyeliner this is an eyeliner pencil so yeah let's go ahead and try this out so far I like the way that it feels you really can't feel it much and the reason why I really don't wear a lot of eyeliners is because my eyes are always watery so if you cannot tell my eyes are already watery um just for me putting this on so And this really does feel good applying it on it doesn't feel rough and I then that's another problem that I find with um, eyeliners I can find that they can tend to be a little bit too rough on my eye line and so that's another reason why I tend to stray away from um, eyeliners as of lately I haven't really been wearing them at all but I really do like the Sephora crayon contour eye pencil this is really nice you guys it's really really comfortable so if you can tell it just gave my eye a little pop a little wake up and yeah I really really do like that so shout out to Sephora again if you're wanting to try out newer products you know or more high-end products and you want to start out small or on a budget definitely check out the Sephora collection you guys you would not be disappointed Alright Queen, so moving on along, um, we got a, an actual hair oil and this is from Living Proof and this is their No Frizz Nourishing Oil and I've actually used this several times. I've, I've actually used this quite a bit you guys because every time that I get these, um, they're usually in sample packets. So this is what it looks like and this is an actual hair oil and if I remembered, I could have used this on my hair you guys this morning. And I could have told you guys again how it actually does work on the hair, but I really do like it. It really does help with frizz because I have used this um, just for like a quick pick me up or if I needed to like take my hair down out of my twist. But as you guys can see, I have my hair pulled back into two low ponytails today. But um, yeah, I really, really do like this. This is from Living Proof and this is their No Frizz Nourishing Oil. I've also seen the Glam Twins here on YouTube rave about this oil, you guys. So that's initially how I was introduced to it so then when I started receiving samples I started using them and the product is really really good they have other products as well from their collection so if you wanted to know more about living proof just go into your local Sephora and try them out because they will give you samples to actually take home you guys if you do not want to make a purchase so stop by Sephora and get your life now this next item I was shocked about you guys because usually we do not get big size um 
packages for conditioning masks or any kind of deep treatment mask or hair mask period they're usually really itty itty bitty but this one is from diva curl and this is the melt into moisture matcha butter conditioning mask it's 100 percent sulfate paraben and silicone free and yeah a lot of people do not know that diva curl is actually in sephora um not every location i think carries it but i know for the most part that you can get it online and they also have their own website as well you guys but yeah diva curl like come through you guys like sephora did their thing with this so i'm probably going to use this this weekend and try it out so if you're wanting to know my initial thoughts about it just follow me over on instagram you guys that's where a lot of you guys find a lot of my first impressions or sneak peeks or even like mini hauls that i do you guys so if you're wanting more daily content just follow me over on instagram at queen she me but back to this um, conditioning mask, it's for a quick moisture boost. Apply it after cleansing and let it sit for three minutes. Need more intensive hydration? Cover your hair with a plastic cap for 15 to 20 minutes. And you guys know I'm extra, so it's gonna be longer than 20 minutes anyways. <laughs> and then it says with or without heat. For maximum moisture, leave on overnight. Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh my God y'all an overnight deep conditioning mask and y'all know i love deep conditioning overnight that is just my thing i've been doing that even before i went natural like i am now like an overnight conditioning mask like oh man okay so i really cannot wait to try this out so let's see how this smells so this is an actual green mask i hope you guys can see that Okay, this is an actual green mask. It is not a white, um, it does not have a white color to it, like, all, um, because any mask that I usually use has either, like, a white, a brown, or, like, a yellow color to it, but this one is actually green. And so, let's see what this smells like. Hmm. It really doesn't have a scent to it, but it may actually become more fragrance once I actually apply it onto my hair. But oh my gosh, you guys, and this is an actual treatment. And it doesn't say that um, people with color treated hair or relaxed hair cannot use this. So if you're wanting to give this a go, I will definitely go into Sephora and per purchase it, you guys. Um, all the products that I'm showing here today, of course, I will leave the links down below so that way you guys can check it out. And if you want to make a purchase, then you can. So again, this is from Diva Curl, and this is their Melt Into Moisture Matcha Butter Conditioning Mask. I should have known better when I said matcha. Matcha is green tea you guys like the strongest version of green tea that you can possibly have so i pray to the gods i pray to the hair guys that diva curl comes through with this overnight conditioning mask because i am excited <laughs> all right and then the last item that we got is a lippy product and this is from siate london siate london and it's spelled c-i-a-t-e um they're, I'm familiar with this brand. They're all over in Sephora. And I've actually swatched a few of their products before. And um, I think I like them. But I just actually have never purchased anything from them. So this is a shade that we actually got this month. And this is a nice size lippy, you guys. Like, look at that. Look at how nice that is. That is a good amount of product. And this is in the shade Diva. Okay, so let's go ahead and switch this and this swatch this. And this is the Liquid Velvet Collection. And again, this is in the shade Diva. So I'm actually just going to swatch this. Ooh, look at that applicator though. That's different. I like that. That's different. I like that a lot. Okay, so we're just going to actually go ahead and swatch this on the back of my hand. I'm looking at my mirror, you guys. And well, I actually got one right here, so let's just do that. Uh, Alright, so that is a very pigmented red. Very pigmented. I mean, that is very opaque. I just swatched over that for extra for whatever reason. I don't know, but I really didn't need that. But that is a very opaque red. I actually do not have a red lippy, so that's good going into the fall holiday months, you guys. And I really do like that. I'm not sure if this is going to dry matte because this is liquid velvet. So I can imagine that this is probably not going to dry matte. This may dry semi-matte, but maybe not completely, completely matte. So usually what I do, if I'm trying to matte out a lippy that isn't a um, matte lipstick, even the ones that come in the twistable tubes, what I will usually do is I'll just take some translucent powder with the um, brush 
um you can just use like one of those flat header brushes or whatever and dip your powder in there and just lightly pat that powder that translucent powder into your lips so that we can set the actual lipstick from being so wet into actually in a sense make it like matte in a sense so i know a lot of makeup artists will do that you guys and i've even done that myself guys i almost forgot about one product <laughs> so this is the benefit gimme brow this is the brow voluminizing fiber gel and i've seen so many um makeup artists rave about this i know recently they had that collaboration with like four or five top influencers and then they had their faces on all the products but this is their um gimme brow and you guys like i know a lot of people have read about this gimme brow gel and i actually want to go ahead and try this on camera for you guys i want to see how it looks on my eyebrows so this is what it looks like this is the mini form this is the gimme brow and we're actually going to try this out on camera So I have you zoomed in because this is the Benefit Gimme Brow Brow Volum Voluminizing Fiber Gel. And this is number five on the top. And it's supposed to give you fuller looking brows. And I actually thought it was going to have like a pigment to it, but I don't think it actually does. It says to use stroke brush tip along brow to define shape brush through to blend and build so i guess it does give your um eyebrows some fibers because i did notice that my brow over here started to look i mean this one over here i'm sorry started to look a lot more fuller this is my thinner brow naturally and this is my thicker brow naturally if you guys are wondering my left side of my hair grows longer than the right side well i wouldn't say it grows longer but it's thicker than the right side i should say so I'm just going to take my little Sephora mirror here. And I told you guys, I love Sephora. I got too much shit from them. <laughs> so it does come like with this little itty bitty 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 like bristle brow. You know, pretty much like a spoolie. It's a mini spoolie as you guys can see here. And it does not, okay, it is some pigmentation. So this is like a black, it's like a black brown fiber gel, you guys. So yeah, um yeah yeah it's like a black brown yeah now i'm seeing it on my brow so yeah this is like a black brown so i'm just actually just gonna take some more of this and it does actually kind of give your brows length oh my god yeah i see it i see it yeah i saw it right here in the front so it does give your brow yeah so if you have like short brows or not so thick brows yeah this would be perfect you guys for you whereas for me with this little right side over here where it's thinner it's going to help to get it fuller for me so i actually let me see here if i can get it so can you guys tell my brow look better yay name does look better than what it did in the beginning i'm not sure but we're going to go to the left side now this brow here this is my thicker brow and i've used benefit products before i actually have two primers from them but i actually haven't tried like their mascara you know like the roller lash one you know when it comes in the pink tube that everyone raves so much about um oh yeah you guys it's actually making this brow I like it and in a sense it kind of tames the brow too now I think I kind of see what the rave is all about I really do like it and you guys know I haven't been to the nail shop to let them touch on my eyebrows in months I just I just touch them up myself I don't really let them do it anymore because they just take too much off this is pretty much what my brows look like after applying the um voluminizing gimme brow fiber gel you guys and again this is in the number five i like really like this you guys like that's dope like you wouldn't even necessarily have to use like the eyebrow pencil because i do have two of the um anastasia um 
brow wisp pencils and I really 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 like those you don't have to be heavy handed at all but this um, benefit gimme brow I really do like it so I see what people are raving about now I really do and I really really do like it I really do like alright queen so that pretty much concludes my video today for unboxing my Sephora play box for September 2017 I hope you guys enjoyed everything that I got this month because I honestly do like what I received this month and I'm so happy um, with the products that I got too as well you guys because pretty much everything that I got I have not tried before so this month was new for me there were no familiar products and I'm so happy that I actually did get these products again I got let's see I got one two three four <laughs> five six products this month you guys so that is dope like i love everything everything that i got this month for my sephora play box so shout out to sephora if you're wanting to know more or even sign up for the subscription you guys please check the description box down below for more information and also all of the links to all of my social media platforms are listed down below and please do not forget to give this video a thumbs up and to definitely make sure that you subscribe you guys and to turn on the little bell so that we can be notified when i upload new content here on my channel for you guys okay thank you so much for hanging out with me today queens and i'll see you guys in my next upload bye you guys